Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperium Galactic Survival. This is your host Zlot, and we are here today. <laughs> and this is Alpha 7.5 Episode 2. You're going to see that I'm actually going to start a new game. What happened was I logged in and I was going to let the, I don't know, it would take about 15, 20 minutes for all the ingots to spin up and, and I just made a little tiny retaining wall so that as soon as daybreak hit, I'd be able to spawn my HV and, and then get the heck out of there type thing, right? Because I knew the CV would be like right there within minutes of daybreak, usually. And so, yeah, what happened was I screwed something up with my survival constructor. And when I went to open up my survival constructor, somehow I hit shift at the same time and I picked up my survival constructor with all my stuff in it. And what happened was the crate of all my stuff bugged completely out. And when I went to open it, it was just empty. <laughs> like everything, all my my fuel, absolutely everything was in there except for a couple couple pieces of food and stuff that I had on me and my gun. It was like, oh my god. And then right then after after I'm scrambling for that, it's like, oh crap! How am I going to fuel my <laughs> my HV that I can just spawn right now? Oh damn! And there's the CV there shooting me up. It's like ah, I give up. So we're going to try it again on a different seed because <laughs> I have no clue where the freaking. Let's just do something small. There we go. Okay, uh, so it should be the same settings. Medium, 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 normal, 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 rich, plenty, true, hard, 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 fast, fast, true, true. Okay. Good and not a cool. We're going to do Omicron. Going to give this sh shot again. So that was a fail. So I failed. Episode one was a fail. <laughs> Bad Z lot. Episode two. Let's see. Okay, so there's a civilian POI right over there. Ooh, that'll be a handy one. Uh, there's another civilian POI right over there. Very, very good. Is there a... Ah, Rescue Havoc module. Okay, excellent, excellent. And we've uncovered a copper by the look of it. We'll head to the... Um, actually, we'll hit these rocks on the way to the module. So we'll just smash down here. Okay, so we know that there was... There's TS Omicron over there. Okay. And the rescue module. Um... So again, we're going to need to find Prometheum. So let's get going here. I did grab everything, didn't I? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So let's equip some of our stuff here. We've got our gun, uh, the drill, the chainsaw. Uh, what else? We'll put the healing there. And hopefully that's all we're going to need for now. Okay. Let's equip the drill, and we're going to switch it to stone removal once again. Let it load up. Okay, so let's run around, grab everything we can, and... Sorry, okay. Had a little keyboard malfunction there for a second. Okay. Come 
Come on. It's sitting a little bit different here. That's why I'm missing the wrong... <laughs> I'm hitting the wrong key is what's happening here. Gather up this stuff as much as we can, and hopefully hit a Promethium deposit this time, or we might have the same outcome. <laughs> because if we don't find Promethium, it'll it probably will be the same outcome. I just want to get all these rocks here while I can. There's also the option of heading back towards the uh, trading station if need be. It's not too far from here. And we might be able to spawn the HV in the trading station. That, that actually is not a bad idea. And there was another civilian POI right around there. We might be able to just take that over or something too. We'll see. And I am cooking right now. 46. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. I think that's only one over, so it's, it's going to take a long time for me to cook. I'll just keep gathering stuff. Get this rock over here. Oh, 47. It's getting a lot hotter. So that's a civilian POI over there. So we might have to make a run for that if it gets too hot. It should be uh, air conditioned. So yeah, my temperature is starting to go up now. Darn. That's not good. Let's put my jetpack on. And we might be able to use one of its platforms to spawn the HV on too. That might be the better solution. Let's just grab our stuff out of here and we'll smash the rest of those rocks over there. Let's see what's in here. Okay, this one is pretty cool. Here's our gear loadout that they give us. A little bit extra, a core. Uh, and that was some more, I think it was five more bottles, some purified water to help with the heat situation, which we are already starting to suffer from. Wow. Uh, I don't really want to fire this base up. I think it's just a waste of my time. Unfortunately, we are cooking hot. I really want to take all of this with me. There's nothing in the tanks, is there? Ooh. I'll just take it all. We should be able to carry everything. Yeah, we've got the uh, we've got the ores already that we're digging up, so we can. And we've already started picking up other stuff. Okay. And we've got our uh, toolbar still. Okay, so I think we need to... We either need to turn this place on or go up into the mountains or head over to that. Jeez. It's not a lot of options, is it? So let's... We're going to have to cool down with this water. Lunch really quick here. And we got to get enough to uh, build this HV or else, or else we're screwed. So I got to smash rocks here. 
It really sucks that it's I'm already overheating. I don't really know what to do about that. I don't know if I can handle I got to I got to hit that civilian one, I think. That's too bad. Oh, level 3, that's good. Doesn't matter if I die. Yeah, damn. I don't know what to do here. That's pretty severe oh. that they uh, overheat you so quickly. I guess I, I doing that to myself with the super hard settings, all right. And no water. I'm gonna have to hit water, I guess. Okay, so I don't think I can make it though. Where's water? that direction. I think I might have a better chance of, uh, I don't know, I, I might have to die on this one. I might just have to overheat and die, like seriously. I don't think I can do this. Yeah, I know. I can hardly travel now. This is going to be bad. I'll try and get as close as I can. Out in the middle of the desert. Yeah. This could be bad. This could be bad. And the temperature's going up. Ooh, do I go for the comfort of the civilian POI? I'm going to get heat stroke here pretty quick and die. Oh, temperature going down. Please tell me the temperature's going down. Yes, the temperature. It's equalizing. Oh, it went into my comfort zone. Yes. <sighs> oh my God, I'm lucky. Okay. Okay, I can... Build stamina back up, and now I can jetpack. Good. Prometheum! Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. Well, we don't necessarily have to do the civilian POI. We could, we could loot that later. I think we... Excellent. Prometheum. Prometheum. Okay, so now we just gotta smash rocks. Now we know where there's Prometheum. As long as it's not guarded, doesn't look like it. And it's over by water too, so that's not bad. 542, that's enough. Actually, let me get some more of these rocks here. We got 344, yeah, we're okay, we're okay. I don't have nearly enough ore yet. And the cobalt's nice, but right now I need the iron, especially, and copper and silicone. Let's actually take some of my oxygen here before I get myself into trouble. Take up half the bottles there. Okay, that's okay. It's a little worried there when the it looked like I was about to get heat stroke, and all of a sudden the temperature dropped. <laughs> like, ooh, lucky.
Okay. Okay. Yeah, we've got some stamina here. Gonna pick everything. <laughs> uh, do I get those rocks here? I'm going to lose time as I root, run in this direction. How is my, what do I got here? I've got enough iron. I do not have enough copper and I do not have enough silicone. Okay, so I have to get rocks. It's okay, I have the nighttime also. And I also need to get fourth level. It'd be nice to get a little bit more over on everything. But we'll see. Those rocks look nice over there. We're getting really far from the Prometheum though, aren't we? Yeah. everything possible smash every rock possible so there's a bunch of rocks over there too okay good so we might have to go over there and get those in fact i think we will have to okay let's head over there Okay, get some more of this. Looks like I'm getting good amounts of everything, so good. Pick everything. Nice. Level four. Okay, good. But I'm still going to pick everything because it. Oh, I found another Prometheum. Nice. This is definitely looking more promising. Oh, over, right over down on the shores of the water? Hmm, that's interesting. That's very interesting now, isn't it? So, where? Hang on. So there's that one there, or that one right on the shoreline. Is there anything guarding it? Doesn't look like it. Hmm. I like the idea of that. Okay, so what's my totals at? So plenty for the iron now. Uh, copper almost. And silicone almost. Okay, so. And we got to get my oxygen down pretty quick. So, so we really need to, we're going to head over here and smash these rocks. This should do it. And we'll, then we'll go do, oh, that's only 160 Prometheum though. That's enough. It is enough. It's enough to get me going and it is a good location. Yeah, let's. Let's do that one. Even if it's only 160, it should be. Ooh, that means. Ooh, that is not a lot. Uh, it'll it'll get me enough to to power up 
and come over and mine the other one, right? Yeah. I don't have to worry about it so much. So let's just take this up. It's getting into night. Turn my light on. So I've got half half my day is used now. I've my goal is always to hit level four and pick a whole have a whole bunch of stuff that can spoil and smash a whole bunch of rocks enough to spawn the I have a little uh, hover box that I spawn in which it has a constructor but it, I need to make a, a grate for it um, I made it so it's only level 3 to spawn in and to make it to make it airtight it had to be level 4 but I'm usually level 4 when I do this but sometimes I am only level 3 when I by the time I uh I need to nest down and and start building a base or figuring out where to hunker down and set my gear down and do all that. So, you know, I wanted to make it cheap enough and easy enough and low enough level to, to be a starter HV. And to tell you the truth, with the with the mobile constructor on it, it makes it more than just a starter HV. It makes it makes it into my base builder, really, because that's um, the only thing I use my survival constructor for is is pretty much building the concrete blocks. Okay, so how are we doing on fifty-two? No, okay. So where's all the rocks? I smash everything? Is that a rock down there? That looks like rocks down there. Damn. We're running out of rocks, really? Okay. No, there's got to be more around here. Um, just I didn't smash all of them, did I? Not all of them, but jeepers! I'm gonna have to use some of my oxygen here. To, uh, I think all I need is silicone now. What am I? At? Yeah, so I got enough copper and iron. I just need more silicone. Oof. Yeah, let's see. Let's see. What does this require here? Oh, I don't have it in the factory yet, so let's put that in. And so 106. So I am 104. 105, 106! Exactly! I could just spawn it in right now. And then I'll be able to... Okay. So I can do it. I can't do make anything else. I can just spawn it. Okay. So that's good to know. I still got quite a bit of time though. We can try and get some... I need to head over to the Prometheum with about eight minutes left, regardless of where I am with with everything else now. Now that I know I do have enough silicone, did I? Not sure if I got everything over there. Ooh. All right, they have. What is that? I'm not sure, and I don't want to know. So, hmm.
Yeah, no. Let's try up here for rocks. On rocks, the elusive rock. It's hard to be a rock star when you got no rocks. Ugh. Eh, I wish I could see rocks <laughs> in the night. They glowed like pentaxid crystals or something. Uh, anything? Yeah, this doesn't look like I'm gonna get anything here because it's not the right. Yeah, oh, this is looking more promising. Oh. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to give up on the rocks for now and hunker down. We're into the nine minute mark here. I have just enough to spawn it in, so that's what we're gonna have to do. I can go I can go get more rocks with it. So And this is a pretty decent location right near the water. I like it. I like it. So we're going to want to stretch in, go into it from this way, from the water, right? So we're going to want to come at it from this direction. Okay, so let's get our gear down really quick just so that we can start grinding up some stuff and we'll get this down right now and we'll put a biofuel in for now that, that'll run for 14 game minutes and produce this oxygen that's fine uh, we'll take our last couple. Okay, so we're producing oxygen. We still got almost a couple hundred. We're fine. That'll that'll keep up with our demand and put us over eventually. So that's good. Um, <clears throat> okay, let's put down the survival constructor too. I'll pick these up in a bit. I just want to get them down so that I can start making stuff. So we want that in there. <clears throat> Excuse me. That, that, that. Uh, I don't want to put everything in. It's just... Uh, that, that. Okay. I think good enough for now. So, we need to produce, first of all, let's make a base starter. And then we'll be, let's turn that on. And then we'll be doing stone dust. So we'll make, I don't know, 100 of that. We'll go for 100 cement after that. And then, the reason I'm not worrying about the ingots right now is I gotta get a base up and going actually. I'm gonna create a fence and and a platform to spawn the HV on, so um, I'm not too worried about creating the ingots so much right now as just getting the blocks, the cement blocks made, so 
Get one of those going. So while it's doing that, and that's producing oxygen, it's already produced one, I'll take it. Uh, we need to eat something. 27, 25. Doesn't really matter. And that's why you want to pick everything on the way too. 15. There we go. That just tops us right up. Okay. So. That's producing oxygen. We need to dig this up. I'm going to get my drone up. And I'm going to actually tab in and tab out just to get my um, radar back. Okay. So let's. I'm gonna, I want to come at it on a pretty drastic angle really so something like this okay let's resource mine Just trying to keep the uh, center of the node in my in the center of the screen. And just move slowly forward. So the object here is to drill through it and past. Um, so this will, it'll be kind of part of the ramp. Just going to keep working our way through here. And just, how's that looking? Not bad, not bad, not bad. Starting to go under the ground there. Yeah, it's looking good enough. I can just widen some of this stuff out later. Let's just keep digging. And this is going to become the base, obviously, if you guys haven't guessed yet. So I figure, why waste my fuel digging up something and then going and digging up a base? Especially when this one's right beside water, this is actually kind of handy. It's not a lot of Promethium, but it'll get us enough to get started and go over and mine the other Promethium. So. This is just a better location, in my opinion, closer to the water. Okay, so it looks, looks like I've reached the center of the node. The writing has disappeared, so... It's okay, what I'll do is I'll just cut right through. Try and keep my trajectory at the same angle for the most part. And we might get it, get lucky and reveal some uh, 
Promethium nuggets here. Well, we well we go through the center of the node. So five and a half minutes before critters show up. I'm gonna have to start digging deeper, I think. Let's see. Yeah, and I have not revealed any nuggets yet. That's really disappointing. Somewhere in these walls. It's too bad. I need to find some, at least a nugget. One nugget. One. Uh, a little, a little tiny stack of ten right now would actually <laughs> be enough to to fuel my world. I mean, hell, the four that I have will will power the HV for a couple times around the planet, really, and. But that's what I'm saving it for. I don't want to power the base with uh, fuel. Besides, I, I, I'm not sure if I'm high enough level to even make a generator. I think I have to make a capacitor right now and do solar. So, really, I don't see any. I haven't revealed any. Wow. Um, this node just sucks. I haven't revealed any? Oh, let's just keep going down. So I've got to go, go a little deeper anyway. Make sure that that's accessible. Hmm. Wow. That's pretty crazy. I'm sure why I can't find any. It's too bad I don't have an ore scanner. <sighs> okay. So it's looking a lot deeper down there. So let's keep going. Maybe, maybe once I dig this out, I'll find some, some nards, right? Okay, so, is that going to be deep enough now? Gotta get this dug a little quicker here. Time is not on my side at this point. I just make, gotta make sure it's gonna be deep enough. Cause I don't want it poking through the ceiling. Or poking through the, uh, the dirt at the top when I dig it out and seal it up. that would suck. That would defeat the whole purpose of this. So I gotta make sure it's deep enough. Okay, so what I'm gonna do right now is I gotta make sure that 
the outside can't see this. So the that's hidden kind of right there. So if I, I'm going to dig down. Okay. So I'm going to go put it in the bottom of that pit and then bring some concrete blocks up from it. So let's do this. We'll grab that and that and that. Okay. And while we're up here, we'll get some oxygen. Oh, that's going to run out soon. that nice we're almost back up to full so we're doing okay on everything right now we're not hungry we're not suffocating that just shut off though so i think we need to use one more of these at least right now because we still got three and a half minutes and i haven't fenced this off yet so um yeah, that's got to get done right now. So what I want to do is get this thing facing the right way. So let's come down here. And we'll face it, keep it that direction. I'm going to drone it up. I don't want to knock my guy into a pit. So I'll <laughs> fly up over him. Because yes, your drone can knock your character around. So be aware of that. Okay, so the block will face the direction that your avatar is facing, not what your drone is facing. Keep that in mind. So that, so that that's why I positioned myself in the facing the way I want. Okay, so that's a little difficult to deal with. Let's go like that, and we'll just get that to sink down a bit. Okay, let's do that. Nice. And then we'll we'll put some blocks on top of that. Ooh, what's going on? Come on. Wait. Why can't I put a block on top of that? Come on. Um. Here. What's going on? Private. Okay. And then. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's just, I should, why can't I put a block on it? What's going on? Is this the wrong, did I make the wrong blocks? I couldn't have, these are concrete. Concrete. Okay. Um. Come on. Why? Really? <sighs> I gotta dig this out. Okay, and what is, I'm not really sure what's going on here. I can't seem to get it to target my, huh, connect to base. Let's try this. There we go. Okay, that's. But I, I'm, I don't know why it wouldn't let me, see it won't let me put it on top. Why won't it? Oh well, I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> ah. Yeah, sometimes alphas do that sort of stuff. So we'll fill this in so that, actually I don't need to fill it in from the, Bottom, I can fill it in from here. 
There we go. Okay. So that'll be the floor there. Okay. Well, let's drill this out. Or actually, now that we have it connected to base, let's get the fence up. Come on. A little disorientated there. Okay. So we want. Uh, it's on a funky angle, is it? Okay. I really did that on a. Oh no. Okay. So we'll just. That's the angle. So it's this way. So. Hmm. Is that going to be far enough up? Hmm. I can do it there. And then pull that. Over more. Okay. And then let's. Oh, it wants. It wants to go under there. I think that's a good idea. Okay, come on. You can do it. Let's stop dittering. There we go. Okay, let's. Drag some blocks down here, and we'll put some there. Okay, and then drag some down, and whoa, yeah. Let's go like that. Okay. And we're going to need more, aren't we? Yeah. Okay. That's okay. Is that wide enough? Let's see. Hopefully. Can we get this right out to the water? Nice, we might be able to. Oh, don't have a lot of time left. Let's, um, we're going to make some more really quick here. Okay, let's get some more blocks going here. Oops. Okay, this might be enough to seal us up. Let's see. Or at least get it to the water. Oh, it looks like it wants to be under there. Yeah. Damn. Well, we'll get it out here as far as possible. Okay, 
And as soon as this spawn, or as soon as the, um, as soon as that's done, we should be good. We need to patch up a couple of real short areas, though. Hopefully we'll have a few minutes to spare. Okay, we're surviving. But there's no predators out yet. And we haven't ran into any drones. But we're surviving the elements. So, there's that, <laughs> I guess. Come on, you can do it. There we go. Couple more. Okay, let's see if we got enough now just to patch this little bit here as the sun comes up. Okay, so hopefully they don't come down into the water. A little bit more of a lip there, okay. How's this doing? Another 50, here we go. There we go. Get these walls up. There we go. Nice, nice, okay. I have no idea how far I need to go out into the water. Um, I think I just want to fill this in now with blocks. Yeah. Oops, guess not. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. The HV can jump over that. Okay, so now we have a bit of a fence blocking critters from just coming into our hole. Um, and as you can see, the sun is out. And spawns should start happening. So it looks like we're going to be okay in our own little gated community. So I think off camera what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue to dig this out. And continue to expand here. Um, and get the get everything moved down. Get all the um, get all the ingots going and um, put that in the factory so that I can spawn the HV and have that all ready to spawn for the next episode, and then we'll uh, go exploring and and maybe go get that other Prometheum or you know see if we can find some here because even though it says that there's 160, I don't see it yet. <laughs> But that's okay. We've got we've got some on us that we can fire up the HV with, and we'll try that next next time. So um, 
if you like this episode, give me a like. Uh, if you want a notification to see when the next episode is out, uh, subscribe. And until then, guys, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.